The commanders of the Russian armed forces, who were not known for their careful attitude towards the lives of their soldiers, have completely lost their boundaries today. The Russian military is being sent en masse into meat assaults, which is why the army is suffering colossal losses. Tension is growing in the ranks of the military. Russian Z War correspondent Maxim Kalishnikov spoke frankly about this. People are being thrown to their deaths. They are being looked at as expendable material, as raw material. If these processes are not stopped in the army, lynchings will begin. People cannot tolerate such an attitude towards themselves, especially during a war, said the Z Patriot. Blogger and military observer Michael Naki suspected that such huge losses of the Russian armed forces in the war against Ukraine are a deliberate policy of the Kremlin. Judging by what I see at the front, Putin has set himself the goal of killing literally all Russian military personnel from the Ukrainian armed forces before a possible freeze of the war. Apparently, he does not want hundreds of thousands of brutalized soldiers to return to civilian life to those who did not send them. The plan in general is clear. You are just used to looking at the arrows on the map. But I, alas, look at corpses every day and there is some kind of mess there. I do not remember such a number of meat attacks even in Bakhmut by Wagner. He wrote in his ex account, long before the invasion of Ukraine, the Russian military had a reputation for a culture of cruelty. Russia has a hybrid manpower system of contract soldiers and conscripts. Although the Russian government claims to have made strides in professionalizing its forces, the country's military still has a brutal hazing system known as Dedovchina, a notorious tradition that encourages senior conscripts to beat, brutalize or even rape younger conscripts. Russia's military has a culture of brutality and scorn for the laws of armed conflict that has been extensively documented in the past. The Russian military repeatedly flouted the laws of war by failing to protect civilians and even attacking them directly. Russian forces have launched indiscriminate attacks, used banned weapons and sometimes apparently deliberately targeted civilians and civilian objects. A war crime. By the end of the year, France intends to keep its promise and transfer 600 high-precision AASM bombs to Ukraine. Brotherly assistance for the Ukrainian armed forces was confirmed through the official account of the French Ministry of the Armed Forces. In addition, the department stated that it will expand the production of these shells, taking into account national needs, and for deliveries to the Ukrainian Air Force. According to plans, the production of these highly effective ammunition will increase to more than 1,200 units by 2025. Aviapro writes that the AASM bombs weighing 340 kilograms are equipped with a GPS and INS guidance system, which means that they have high accuracy when hitting ground targets. This aircraft projectile was developed for fighters such as the French Rafale. But experts say that the MiG-29, 
SU-27, and F-16 will also fit. With the help of the guidance system, the AASM can carry out pinpoint strikes on fortified objects and equipment. In France, they say that such military assistance will be a serious support for Ukraine in the current conflict. The AASM's modular design supports different bomb weights, from 125 kg to 1000 kg, and includes an aerodynamic extension kit with winglets and a rocket booster to increase range. The AASM, also known as the Hammer, is a versatile French air-to-surface weapon developed by Safran Electronics and Defense, suitable for both close air support and long-range strike missions. This smart weapon is modular, allowing it to be configured with various guidance systems according to operational needs. The most common version integrates a hybrid inertial navigation system and GPS for guidance, achieving high accuracy with a circular error probability of about 10 meters. For enhanced precision, variants equipped with infrared or laser guidance can strike targets within 1 meter of accuracy, even against moving targets.